Hi, everybody, with Eddie Olchek and Ray Ferraro. I'm Mike Emery. October, first month of the hockey year, and a great time for a strong start to the season. Close to dropping the puck now, Eddie. What's your thought? These two teams both need the W here tonight. I can see him playing it safe early, but the question is, which team will make the first mistake? We have a thrilling evening of hockey ahead. Underway with more hockey action in Winnipeg. Belarus has gotten the goalie to the bench and the extra man's on. The Jets get a minor penalty for charging. And so begins power play number one. Let's see if it's power play goal number one. Truba's got it on his stick, trying to get it out of there. Nobody stands around on his power play. Somebody is always moving. Absolutely. I think you're right, Eddie. Let's see what the team does here. Moves behind the net. No time to react. They score! A power play goal. And it's a biggie. Oh, what a quick release on that snapper. Oh, he can't get his pad down quick enough to make this stop. Really good shot, as you mentioned, Eddie. I think that's one he should probably stop. Winnipeg's got it off the draw at center. In all alone! Oh, what a stop! Belarus has it and moves it through center ice. The puck is fielded now by Buffalo. Gains the zone. Looking from the corner. Angled to Buffalo. With a drive! Wonderful save. What skill by both goalie and shooter. Under five minutes play, it's a one-nothing game. Nice face-off work. Belarus looking to wheel it up the wing. Oh, how can they miss that pass? Scooped up. Forcing attention in deep. Good quick poke check there. Winnipeg's in control of the puck in their own end and readying an attack. Still with it in the defensive zone. Brought ahead towards center. He's got that pass. One into another. Well, we thought he was going to escape there. He got knocked on his backside pretty solidly. Turned a shot on that. Had the goalie beat and glanced it off the post. Seeks the corner. Enormous hit. Puck gathered in behind the net. Waits from the corner. Cranks one. He scores! Well, he had a lot of time and space there to let that wicked shot go from far out. That is a heavyweight shot. Enzo, good airtime on this pass. Flat when it lands, and the shooter has a walk in. Winnipeg's prevailed again on the face off of the neutral zone. Mikhail Grabowski assisted. Glanced off the post. Winnipeg starting back in their own end. Handed right back to Truba. Gets across, looks over his options. Laid on to Thorber. Through the corner now. Slides it to the point to Truba. Trying for it. Shifley's hooked on the play. There will be a penalty. Winnipeg's got their man over on the delayed call, and the goalie rests at the bench. Pulls his way along. Step score! They're back to within one. and feel the defensive players were just running out of gas. They were running around their own zone. You got to tip your helmet to the offensive players for that shift. They really had it coming. 
Under three minutes still showing on the clock this period. The lead has just been cut in half. Let's see if there's a shift in momentum. Pass cut, strong play. Puck is thrown to Wheeler. Nearing the last minute of play in the first. Waffle boarded. Time of the goal. a prime scoring area. What a stop. The first period has come to a close, and we do have a score. It's a close game after one. You'd expect that from these two. Hockey's narrowest lead is what we have here. One goal. Middle period has just begun. Take it away. To the point it comes. And the pickup. Belarus wanting to generate something. They'll try up the wing. Thrown in. Looking for options through the neutral zone. Shot blocked with a pad. We're going to get a penalty. It's a delayed call. Wheeler sent to the box. Two minutes for boarding. Anything you do once, you can do twice. Let's see if that applies to this particular power play. The Jets with a clean win on the draw. Belarus in their own end lugs that along. And he steps across the line. Using the point. Score! A power play goal yet again. Slap shot had some steam on it. Oh, he's trying to be aggressive, though. He just can't get out there quick enough to stop this shot. A little over four minutes have transpired in the period. Just recently, another goal, and so the lead is two. And he steps across the line. That play is offside, and so back to center ice for the face. Thing. Winnipeg's collected another victory on the faceoff. Looks ahead to start something. Motors along up center. Fires! That hits somebody. On the outside, a shot. They score! It's only a one goal game now. Goaltender was surprised at how quick that snapshot got on top of him. I think when he takes a look at this on video, he's going to see he was in really good position, and he just wasn't able to stop a perfect shot. Solid win at center ice. Now what? Fires! Lucked out of the defensive zone. Walking a thin line near the border there. Moves it to the corner. On to Kostitsin. Up the wing still with possession and with hope. Winnipeg's moving the puck in their own end. And in flight over the line. Good chance. Denied. Long lead pass to Enstrom. Pressing on with it up the wing. Got that pass near the blue line and now looks ahead. A penalty coming up, but it's a delayed call. And so now a penalty will be handed out. Winnipeg's got two for charging. The power play has been well oiled. They've connected twice already. Let's see what develops off this faceoff. That puck careened out of play over the glass. Didn't look like anybody got hurt there. Winnipeg's got two up on the penalty board for delay of game. We have a winner. Try to clear the puck. The Jets shoot it back out. Got some time to check the clock and prepare to defend again. Winnipeg's in possession as they travel through center ice. Held up against the boards. Scrum over, puck kicked. Clear. A lot of work, but penalty time less and less now. 
shot on. Score! A short-handed goal! Rose, quick hands, a lot of the snap that one off and score the goal. Really good positioning. He's in the butterfly where he's got most of the net covered. But there's obviously a hole in the pucks behind him. Winnipeg goal. Good job on that faceoff, tying the man up. On through the corner. The Jets have killed it all. Trying to go to Grabowski. That one's off the frame. And now it's directed to Shifley. Passing one off now to Bufflin. Keeps it going behind the goalie. One-timer. Just couldn't find the target. And the linesmen were watching very carefully. That is an offside. Good reach there. Gets in. What'll he do? Through the corner. Back near the blue line to Bufflin. Just missed the net with that one. You can almost count that one, but no, what a save. In the second period. 42 seconds showing. A shot. Score! Not much time left, but enough for that one. You want to score goals, you've got to get to this area of the ice. The goalie thinks he's got the bottom half of the net covered. Obviously, he doesn't as this goes by him on the low stick side. Got possession. He moves that one ahead through center. By number 19 and by number 26. Time of the goal, 19 minutes, 52 seconds. 40 minutes down and 20 to go. Plenty of scoring and maybe some more. It's close. After all of those shots, it's a one-goal difference. And he is closed off emphatically. Sometimes nowhere to go. He tried to squeeze through, guys, but he took a big hit. Around through the corner. Outstanding stop. A quality chance, a better save. He's got it. To Wheeler. Onside. Wheeler's lost that puck in the offensive zone. He stick-handled himself in the submission. Not a free puck now. The Jets want to generate something up the wing. That's a good solid poke check. That's terrific work with the pad. Corralled by Dustin Bufflin. Carried from the defensive zone towards center. The Jets in their own end in possession as they travel. Got it in his own end. The Grabowski gains the blue line. Snapping a pass to Buffalo. Pitching it to Shifley. Swept on. Score! Slap shot like that, you got to get your whole body into it. He did. Winnipeg's third period goal has tied this game, and there's still plenty of time to go. Plus, the momentum seems to have gone to them. Good intercept. Belarus in control as they travel up the wing. He's alone, and he got that one. Oh, and he is drilled. Shoots one, got a piece of that one. Oh, wonderful play. Play is stopped, and now we'll hear the call. Belarus has been assessed a minor penalty. The call is holding. There's always a start to your power play night, and this is number one. Puck corralled by Enstrom. The Jets wheel it up the wing. He throws it there. Held to the glass. Skate kick out of the scrum. What a hit! Saw him coming just at the last minute. He's able to spin off, but that's a big hit. And he is reefed. Sailed right back in again so the defense can get to the bench. 
The Jets in their own end in possession. A chance to clear. Knocked right off the stick. Pointed to Enstrom. Oh, what a break. That shot hit somebody. Belarus is all done with the penalty kill. We're back even. Turned away. Nicely into the zone. Score! He's got his second. Well, I know that shot was really hard, Doc, but where he put it was more impressive to me. Belarus has gotten the one goal lead at a critical time in the game. Third period. Not many shifts left per team. Moves into the shadow of the boards. He's held up there. Kicked out of the scrum. Good play. What a reaction save. A missed opportunity from this close in. Off his pad. There are a few ways to stop the momentum against you. That's one way. Cover up and reset. Over four minutes remaining in the period. We had a tie game until just moments ago. It's a one-goal contest. Got his pad on that one. Gaining space may be time. Score! And the game is even. The key to this goal on the one-timer, hands away from the body and follow through. And so just because you're in the butterfly doesn't mean you can give in to the shooter. You still have to move. He looked like he thought he was in perfect shape to make the stop and didn't have to move. Bad guess. Sets up shot, and that one turned aside. They win the draw. Let's see if it pays off. Propelled the Grabowski. Back on his stick. Winnipeg's in their own end, setting things up. Headed to a wild finish. Game even. Fans screaming. Some of them hoarse, I'll bet. Takes that pass. Around to the corner. Good stick. Oh, what a stop. Uh, with this puck being so close to that, this is all a reactionary save. Big save there. 35 to go. Back in his defensive end to get it. A quick got it all. Oh, that puck just hit his glove. And he holds on. Coming up is the largest play in this game so far. The largest play. It's a draw. The Jets wheel one ahead up the wing. Wheeler's trying to do way too much there with that offensive opportunity. Scorches one. Good shot, but a better save. Oh, and he's hammered. You want to be into a game, hit or be hit. We are underway in overtime. Who's the hero going to be? Belarus has it in the defensive zone. Into the attacking end. Fires! Big point-blank save there. Not often you're all alone in front of the goaltender from this area of the ice. Great save. And they've won that draw. Hatchets won! Score! The overtime winner! And the players spill over the boards to celebrate. And the game is over. Well played, it was. When it gets to OT, it seems like the smallest thing can happen and then go wrong for a team. In this case tonight, it went right for one. The little extra plays that make all the difference.